legal protections for lesbian, gay, bisexual and transgender people vary widely across Latin America from countries like Argentina and Uruguay that allow same-sex unions to countries such as Belize and Jamaica that outlaw sexual relations between couples of the same gender. In the past few years, a wave of pro-LGBT legislation has swept through the region as well as a group of LGBT rights groups pressing for stronger protection. In 2010, Argentina became the first country in Latin America and the second in the hemisphere to legalize sex marriage. With that legislation, Argentine gay couples are entitled to all the same rights and benefits as straight couples, including adults. That law allows people to undergo sex change operations of their own volition and to change the legal gender on government documents free of charge, even without first undergoing a sex change. Since the law went into effect, over 3,000 people changed their gender on government issued ID. As of 2009, Argentina's armed force permits the entry of gay and lesbian service members and bans discrimination within that body. However, no nation now exists that deals with discrimination based on sexual orientation or gender identity, even if one faced the change of the police in 2010 and weight debate in the Senate. Verified in January 2009, Bolivia's new constitution prohibits discrimination based on sexual orientation and gender identity. However, the constitution also restricts civil unions and marriage for opposite sex couples. The law against racism faced in October 2010 protects against discrimination based on sexual orientation and gender identity. The law not only includes discrimination from individuals, but also from public and private institutions as well as the media. A 2011 bill proposed given equal rights to same-sex couples, such as patrimony and social security rights. In April 2011, Congresswoman Erica Clary introduced a bill that would legalize same-sex unions. In Brazil, LGBT rights largely eastern from local and state based legislation and judicial decisions. In May 2011, Brazil's Supreme Court ruled that same-sex unions were legal and that gay couples are entitled to the same rights as a jurisdictional cops, including health, pension and patrimony benefits. Brazil does not have the laws banned same-sex cops for adopting. Even if the landmark Supreme Court ruling set a precedent that could allow them to do so. Transgender citizens may be able to legally change their names and gender by going to court. Brazil's first transgender identity case took place in 2007 after a court ruled that a transgender woman who had undergone surgery could change her name and sex on national identification. She offers two protection for the LGBT. Even if the legislation does not specifically mention sexual orientation or gender identity, it outlaws any discrimination that readies the legitimate exercise of fundamental rights. In 2007, the Chilean Supreme Court ruled that transgendered men and women could legally change their name and sex. In September 2012, 
a Chilean LGBT group brought a case before the Inter Inter-American Commission on Human Rights against the Chilean government for refusing to legalize gay marriage. Chilean courts refused to marry three gay couples in 2010. In April 2013, the Commission said the case was admissible and will move ahead. The same month, the Senate's Constitution Commission approved the Civil Union's bill. LGBT rights in Colombia have been on largely through the country's judicial system. In 2009, Colombia's constitutional court ruled that cohabitation same-sex couples must be granted all the same rights as their straight counterparts, including rights to property and social security benefits. Then, in 2011, that court ruled that the country's legislature must approve same-sex marriage or an equivalent. In 1999, that court made discrimination based on sexual orientation illegal. Within the armed forces, through this has been overlooked by the military. However, in 2011, Congress passed anti-discrimination legislation with sexual orientation as a protect category that allows to place jail time and steep fines for violations. Colombia's Congress voted against a bill to legalize same-sex marriage in April 2013. However, the 2011 Supreme Court ruling is slated to take effect on June 21. Any LGBT rights are offered in Costa Rica, based in 1998, for high discrimination based on sexual orientation, with a penalty of fines. However, on of the central LGBT issues in Costa Rica is same-sex unions, since the country's family code forbids gay marriage. In May 2006, Costa Rica's Supreme Court ruled that gay marriage is unconstitutional, and in August 2010, the court ruled against a referendum which would have been allowing citizens to decide on same-sex unions. President Laura Tintija is in favor of legalizing same-sex unions, but not marriage. Costa Rica's parliament is considering legalizing same-sex unions. In June 2012, the legislature's commission on human rights rejected a same-sex union's bill, but in issue is still under debate in Congress. In the case of Cuba, there is a mixed record on LGBT rights. While the Castro govern government stalked homosexuals in the early days of the revolution, often sending them to prison and work camps, Fidel Castro signs apologized for his actions, calling them a great injustice. Cuba discriminated gay sexual relations in 1979 and since 2008 performed sexual reassignment to Jerry free of charge. Cuba's 1992 constitution outlaws any form of discrimination harmful to human dignity but does not explicitly name sexual orientation or gender identity. However, at the Communist Party conference in January 2012, the government said it would work to end sexual orientation discrimination for party membership or government votes. Even if Cuba's constitution defines marriage as a union between a man and a woman. Cuban President Raul Castro's daughter Mariela has pressed the Cuban Parliament to pass legislation legalizing same-sex union. She hinted on could be debated by the end of this year. Quito projects both gay and transgender rights. The Constitution of 1998 banned discrimination based 
on sexual orientation, making Ecuador of the first countries in the world to do so. The country's new constitution, based by referendum in September 2008, also encompasses gay rights. Well, however, in it bans same-sex marriage as well as adoption of children by same-sex couples. Transgender persons have been able to change their sex on national identity cards by requesting the change in, in card. Congress is debating a reform to the country's federal ID law and whether to allow people to choose which gender to put on identification. In 2009, the Federal District of Mexico City legalized gay marriage and granted gay couples the right to adopt. The Chamber of the Deputies faced legislation guaranteeing social security benefits to same-sex couples in May 2012. So the minister is installed in the Senate. However, in May 2013, the Institute for Social Security and Service for State Workers, which administers social security and health benefits for federal government employees, began allowing same-sex couples to receive the wealth benefits. In 2003, medical extended protection for discrimination to LGBT citizens, facing the federal law to prevent and eliminate discrimination. In Peru, there are limited protections for gay and transgender citizens. Based in May 2000, Peru's anti-discrimination law bans prejudice based on sexual orientation with jail sentence of up to five years. However, gay rights activists are pushing for stronger legislation as discrimination against gays continues. In June 2004, the country's constitution court ruled against a law that prohibited gay sexual relations in the military. Gay Peruvians are legally able to serve in the police and armed forces following a court ruling in December 2009. Uruguay offers main protections for the LGBT community. It was the first Latin American country to legalize same-sex union, facing the civil union law in December 2007. The law gives same-sex couples similar rights to marriage, including health, pension, patrimony, and providing benefits, as long as the couple has been together for at least five years. The country was also the first in Latin America to pass a law allowing gay couples to adopt children in September 2009. In December 2012, the lower house of Congress approved the Marriage Equality Law Bill, which gave the same-sex couples the same rights as other sexual couples, including the right to marry. The Senate approved the bill in April 2013, and President José Mujica signed the law in May. The law goes, goes into effect on August 3. In November 2009, the gender change law passes, which allows citizens to change their name and sex on government issued documents. Those who wish to change their gender or name are not required to undergo an operation.